things that we are figuring out as we get used to life with the Rivian is the cost of charging. How that can vary from state to state because some states do not allow charging stations to charge by the kilowatt hour and they have to charge by the minute because they're considered a power company if they charge by the kilowatt hour. So we wanted to compare that today. What do you get when you're being charged by the minute, which is what um, in the state of Nebraska we do is we get charged by the minute or if we um, get, you know, what can you get or how does that compare to in Iowa where you get charged by the kilowatt? So we're ripping up and down the interstate to try to get to a similar state of charge. Uh, we've gotten close. It's only about uh, one percentage off. That'll just help us have the similar amount of heat loss. This is Electrify America, so it should be a similar um, a charging curve. So uh, we'll charge up to what our last charge was. And we got, what was it? How many kilowatt hours was it? Was it 34? I believe so. That sounds so right. 34. And then we'll cut it off there and we'll compare price with that. Um, there. So, anyways. Yeah. So, we'll uh, pull into the charger here and get hooked up. This is any different. Last time we charged, it was 39 kilowatt hours. So, all right, let me get the Electrify America app pulled up. I'll do this part. Okay, connecting the vehicle. So this actually does uh, bring up a topic that is that was something that we get asked a lot, which is um, how is the reliability of the CCS network versus the Tesla network? Um, and we've charged this truck one other time so far outside of our at our home, and that time like it worked great, but this time it's not doing so well. So. Truck, so. Red on the truck, so all right, we try again. There we go. Okay, hey, that worked. All right, all right, okay, no account found. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So the one thing that we did last time that worked because the, I don't know if what it is, RFID chip or what what is in the phone that helps you do the tap. scam, tap yeah. payment, um, is just, I go in to pick the station, there's a number up above, so in our case this is number two, and then I initiated it, and then it actually went. Um, so that seems to work better for us. Uh, at least the two times we're not we're not experts. So no, not at all. By any means, I'll still try the other way just because it would be nice just to be able to use my. Is that called Apple Pay? What's that called? Yeah, like, Apple Pay. Like yeah. just you know tap on your phone and yeah. Like so. Anyways, we start with a similar state of charge. Um, twenty four percent on the last one, twenty five percent on this one, and then we'll just go up until. Electrify America says they've delivered 39 <laughs> kilowatt hours, and then we will compare the two. Yeah, so let's compare costs and all that kind of stuff. So, but uh, this is the not exciting part. We just watch the numbers go up and down. Yeah, it's pretty exciting for me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but, but currently let's... we're at 198. So let's see what we get. Ooh.
So we saved five dollars. It cost twelve dollars and ninety-four cents. We got thirty-nine kilowatts. Let's go talk about it. Three seventy-three. Three dollars and seventy-three cents versus twelve dollars and ninety-four cents. <laughs> Holy moly! Maybe we should just travel in Nebraska. <laughs> well, so. Let's talk about reasons why. Okay, hold on. We're, I'm going to switch cameras and then we'll talk about okay. it. Okay. You should just keep your travels to states that charge by the minute instead of the kilowatt. Yeah, so... Yeah, because it costs 33 cents. This is with all tax and everything. 33 cents a kilowatt uh, for this Electrify America oh. versus our other session costs cost us 9 cents a kilowatt hour. That is a crazy difference. Yeah. Like that, we pay uh, roughly about eight cents a kilowatt hour at home. Okay. With that per minute session, at that such a high rate of charging, it's a freaking bargain. And somebody had asked us a question: How far can you go on a hundred dollars? And so that was. And that brought us to to think about that, what the difference of those two costs were. So the reason one cost, what were the numbers again? Uh, 33 cents yeah. per kilowatt versus nine cents. The reason that one cost 33 versus nine <coughs> cents is because you're getting a higher charge rate. And so if they're, how they figured it out uh, or charging by the minute, if you stay low in your battery pack, you are going to be at that 200 kilowatt hour charging. Electrify America has got to be losing money, to be honest, on that one, because that's close to what we're paying at home. Uh, yeah. With, you know, with, like a penny yeah, <laughs> is how close. Kind of crazy to think about. Anyway, so that's why you're doing that. So, in theory, to get through the state of Nebraska, you could have. You know, you can keep your battery low and travel really cheap. And I'm assuming it's the same thing in those other states. So if you would like me to figure that out, the, what that would cost, I'll go run and uh, do some charging in the state of Nebraska and see how much it would actually cost to drive through the state or even on average what it would take um, to, to go through a state that only charges by the minute and what the best way to do that is so let me know if you'd like that with that person asking how far can you get on a hundred miles uh, we can't figure that out for the per minute one that that's a bit difficult if we charged at home at eight cents a kilowatt we would be able to go what was it like we would be able to go the, according to the EPA uh, it would be 3,140 miles so that's a long ways on yeah. So. so if you're if you know if you're going on a trip, obviously you have to hit chargers unless you charge like your buddy's house and then pay him for it or whatever. Um, but you know, at home we can go over three thousand miles on a hundred dollars if we're charging only at home. That's insane. Yeah. <laughs> That's so far. But if you have to go to the chargers where you're getting you know, where you are accruing fees per kilowatt, what was that? Or per kilowatt hour, yeah. what was that? So that was 700, roughly 750, it's 757 to be exact, at that 33 cents a kilowatt hour. So there's how far you can go on, you know, comparing like the cost of for when you're getting charged from by the minute or by the kilowatt hour, and then about how far you can go um, on a hundred dollars. So be sure to give this video a thumbs up, drop us a comment. What else do you guys want to know? We love to answer questions. It, it's fun for us to go figure this stuff out. So subscribe. Yes, subscribe, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Hey. See you guys.